So most people are familiar with the Mars rovers. Curiosity is the rover that's, that's on the surface of Mars right now. Our idea is that if you could replace this single, extremely expensive and sort of fragile robot with a swarm of robots, you could do vastly more in terms of space exploration. Swarm robotics is a, is a new area in robotics. It's an area where people are just finally having the hardware, um, the, the, the physical robots, to be able to program. And so there's an enormous software challenge. How do you design algorithms that control the robots, that tell the robots where to go, but importantly, that allow them to interact with their environment? The Swarmathon is something that myself and my now postdoc, Joshua Hecker, conceived as a Swarm Robotics programming challenge. We are engaging students um, now from 44 different universities around the country to design algorithms to control these swarmy robots. There's a second challenge that we're really trying to address here, and that is that um, there's a huge disparity in the, the kinds of students and the kinds of professionals you have in computer science in particular. So we are really trying to encourage more women, more underrepresented minorities, African American, Native American, uh, Hispanic, Latino students to participate in this competition. And last year we had an amazing set of teams that participated, 80% were from underrepresented groups and they came up with new algorithms, really creative approaches, showed some excellent teamwork and problem solving and, and overcoming some of these challenges. I never really thought that robotics would be something I could approach because to me it always seemed like this incredibly expensive, incredibly like, you know, just beyond the reach of what I had um, as far as an engineer. We started doing research and we essentially uncovered many, many different pieces of hardware, um, you know, software out there that was um, either very low cost or free. Eventually we got to the uh, NASA Swarmathon, which was a sort of a partnership between UNM and NASA, and we were able to build these guys as cheaply as we could. And um, that was, you know, what it was all about. We sort of took our enjoyment of robots and our, you know, the fact that we could get into this at such a low barrier and try to push that out to all the schools and all these other, you know, uh, teams around the country and give them the same uh, experience, basically. It's un unbelievably cool. It's <laughs> this is the most fun I've had as a faculty member, certainly. And it's really rewarding to work with the students and also to be able to play with robots. <laughs>